In this video, I'm going to teach you how to play Rocket League with a Switch controller on PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to show you an easy way to set up any controller that you have, including specifically for this video, the Nintendo Switch Pro controller on PC. So as you can see, I have the Epic Games Launcher and Steam open, and I own Rocket League on both of them. For the method that I'm going to show you in this video, what we're going to be doing is running Rocket League through Steam. Don't worry, this is also going to work if you didn't originally purchase Rocket League through Steam, because you can add the Rocket League executable to Steam as a non-Steam game. So first, if you already own Rocket League on Steam and you play by running it through this launcher, just right click on Rocket League, go over to Properties and then Controller. All that you have to do is make sure that Steam Input is enabled for all controllers. So if it is set to use default settings or disabled, go over to Enable and you will see that Nintendo Switch now has enabled Steam Input. Steam Input is a feature automatically built into Steam that is going to detect and set up any controller that you connect to your PC. You can go over to the controller configurator and this window will open. And as you can see, there is a little switch icon over here. Now, I want to make something very clear. I am currently using an Xbox controller. I apologize. I don't have a switch controller to demonstrate how this is going to look like, but the process is exactly the same. It's only going to look visually different on the layout. But as you can clearly notice, you will be able to make your own layout, change all of the buttons, see the layout and you can browse through community made layouts or official ones made for the game. So as long as you have any Steam input layout active you will be good to go. Now this works if you natively own Rocket League through Steam. If you don't then you will have to do some additional steps first. Go over to your library, select add a game at the bottom and then add a non-Steam game. Now in this list you will be able to look for the Epic Games Launcher. Usually it should pop right up but if you don't see it click browse over here and you will be able to explore your computer to find where the executable for the Epic Games Launcher is located. As long as you can find it where it is usually under program files you will be able to add it here and you can also go ahead and add the Rocket League executable from the Epic Games Launcher. Once again I don't think I have to do that because I own it on Steam but if you do just go over to your Epic Games folder and you should be able to add it there. So as long as you have everything set up and everything added to the Steam Launcher, you can either run Rocket League through Steam or run the Epic Games Launcher directly and then select the option to run Rocket League when you get inside. I hope I was able to help you on how to play Rocket League with a Switch controller on PC. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.